between the pipes of Carolina, the All-Star Game, of course, and the skills competition on ESPN. We are underway in Raleigh. John Butchercross, Kevin Weeks, Ryan Callahan between the benches. Beautiful skater, blockered by Anderson into the corner. Wierenski throws it around the other side, but it's kept in by Boquist. He was the other part of the Seth Jones trade. Didn't seem like they'd have much leverage, but still got a very, very good return on draft day. Hurricanes now looking to create some offensive zone time. That was Brendan Smith with the shot towards the net. And here comes Texier, as Ryan Callahan mentioned. Good face-off team. They can score off face-offs. And they almost do there. Wow, what a twisted wrister. Bucci. And a clean face-off win, to your point, that Kane's the best face-off team in the league. Trocek wins it clean. Spechnikov slick. Nice play there by Bolquist. Borenski, the defenseman up, trying to create something. And there's Freddy snatching the glove on the shot from Max Domi. Allowing the shot from the outside, well played. Jordan Stahl, game 1,046 of his career. In front, wraparound, dangerous for a second. Stahl, rebound blocked. As they battle in the neutral zone, and here comes Texier again. Behind the net now, there he is. Texier is flying tonight. His feet are really moving. Shot from the point. Anderson is loose. Backhand save. Rebound score! Emil Bedstrom, the Swede. And White, you were just talking about Ibuchi, and he does a really nice job on the boards, drawing double coverage and then going back to the point. Now, watch Freddie Anderson. One, two, three saves by Freddie Anderson, and it's Emil Bedstrom with the eventual goal here at Cali. Yeah, Rosselvik doing a great job in front of the net, taking away Anderson's eyes, battling for it, and Bedstrom coming right down the slot, gets it to his backhand, and that's a big goal right there. And I tell you what, for Texier being his first game back and forth, getting on the score sheet. Pushes players, and you can tell he loves being a coach and he knows he needs to be patient. Borkstrand with a wicked wrist shot. It's behind him. Is it in? No. No. Still alive and now waved off again. That puck was standing on the goal line. Mike Lloyd is still in. All right. Let's take a look at this. Freddie Anderson, the initial save. Two, three chances and it gets banked off of him. But it's the presence of mind by the Minnesotan Brady Shea. Yeah. 76 in red. Cali. Great play by Brady Shea there. It is. Look at this. He knows he's trying. He's trying to bank that in. He sees Anderson's off his post and that's going in if it wasn't for Shea. He saves it up. Uh-oh, some space now for the Canes. Garbage in front, yeah, what a save, rebound! Yes, has entered the building! The Smurfs League hits, reads this play so well. Here come the Canes with their speed, using their speed coming down the wing. But watch Elvis, not one, but two. He's got his blue suede shoes on. <laughs> Chinnikov fires just one, rebound slap, high shoulder save by Anderson. Man down, no arm in the air. Play continues. Columbus wants a penalty. Drops it back. Natchez. Oh, oh, look out. Oh, oh. Texier to make it 2-0. Oh, he tried a little pump check. Didn't get it to go. He's an absolute shootout master with that move. Team shots on goal. They made it 1-0, and Alexander Texier. He's got a lot of bags of tricks, and he almost had the one-hander five-hole. He gave it a shot. Freddie Anderson says, how about no? See, the Hurricanes trying to impose their physical will. You wonder if Rob the Bod said something behind the bench. This young team should not be dominating us. It's loose! And Fred Rob the Bod, the horn style! Stahl and Jenner eyeball to eyeball to begin the second. Kind of like how Kevin Pollock and Francois St. Laurent are calling this game. They're kind of calling it like a playoff game. Two on one for Columbus. Here they come. The teenager, Sillinger with Borkstrand. Borkstrand. Shot saved by Anderson. He got to take a while to sell the puck. That gave Anderson plenty of time. Doing his work along the wall. Here's Jarvis. Really good looking player. His 25th NHL game. Puck loose in front. Stahl. Jarvis. Beautiful pass in front. It's loose. Oh! What a blocker save by Elvis! That was fluttering towards the net! Going far side, and you're right, that did just miss by inches there. Oh, look at Cock in the end, he's feeling it. He's feeling it! What a pass! D'Angelo couldn't get enough on that! He had a yawning cage. Look out, breakaway! Uh-oh! And Chinnikov, score! Wow, how often do we see that? Igor Chinnikov, third of the year. He was the 21st overall pick in 2020, Cali. What's a goalie thinking when he's coming down on you like this? Well, I'll tell you one thing. He's thinking he's shooting middle of the net. And Chinnikov had other ideas. He goes low blocker. Watch him pick his head up there. Leg over the fire. Mm -hmm. 
also offering guidance. Jarvis behind the net. Carolina needs one here. Open in front. Yeah, oh, no. First leak gets another great save. Aho had a great chance. And every game feels like a playoff game, especially when you're playing against the East. And watch this save by Elvis Merzlikens, who went laterally from his right post over to his left and took the right diagonal line. And here it is here in your living room. Watch him push and gets angle, pushes that glove forward a la Nikolai. And that should spur them on to at least give it their best. But watch out, Shvestikov, saved oh, by oh, Merzlikens. Oh. He actually, he, he kept that. This team has been a key PK beast since Ron Brindamore has been hired. Trocek, short-handed, in a long shot, saved by Merzlikens again. Another kick, holy shnike. Freddie versus Elvis. Blue Jackets on the power play for 16 more seconds. The Hurricanes have had 20 scoring chances in this game. And keep in mind, they're the best third period team in the NHL. Plus 25 goal differential. They have a finishing kick. They've been thoroughbreds all season long, but they're down 2 nothing to a hungry Columbus team. You see the fans come right in. They, nice they play. sense that. These good fans in Raleigh. Oh yeah. Turnover. Jenner. Goes across one timer score. Play. Holy shnikes. Patrick Lyonne. Absolute box office. The bomb makes it three-nothing. Now Kane's in full possession, but they lose it. Now watch this stop up by Boone Jenner. Stop up, snap it all the way across. Elite. Elite. Great play here, Callie. And it all starts by Nyquist going through, right? He draws the defenseman back, opens up that lane. And Oriati Cody and, and talk to them and just get a little insight on what made them so great because Patrick Liney, having seen him up close several times, he has all the tools. In front, Chinnikov score! Yegor Chinnikov, second tuck of the night, and suddenly it's 4 0 Columbus. Outstanding anticipation. The Canes get really concentrated in their D zone on the right side, and they allow Chinnikov to walk right down the field like he just came here from Chapel Hill. Are you kidding me? Oh. Absolutely nasty oh. backhand toe drag. As he relieves Freddie Anderson with his team down 4 nothing. Rod Brindamore looking for a spark in these final 14-33. Breakaway now. Columbus looking to make it 5 nothing, And they do. And, and this is such a tough spot for him to come into. Snaps this one. The Canes with a miscue at the offensive blue line. Watch Cole Sillinger, who played one season in Medicine Hat in the WHL, with the league being played on a limited schedule last year, came down to the USHL, Cali, and played and made this NHL club. This one, they hold on to it, increased the lead in the third period. So well done by Columbus. Oh, it oh, what a play by Boquist. He saved the goal. One timer Trocheck. 6'3, 215. And use every bit of that 6 3 2 15 day. Oh, Razzlevic loses it! But Merzlikens has his back again. Carolina looking to get on the board. Threatening again. Natchez in front. Puck bounces around. Taken out of danger there by number 52, Camille Benstrom. Jack Razzlevic to make it 6 0. Yes. Razzlevic, sixth goal of the year for the Columbus, Ohio Nate. 6 0. Yeah, the Canes go to the boards as Ethan Bear. And well recognized by Alex Texier, who springs Roslovich. And Roslovich just, here's a look at that dish. Great dish here, Cali. It is. Texier is having himself a game in his return to the line. Columbus Blue Jacket organization. And for those fans back in the 614, a perfect night for them and a perfect night for Elvis as he gets his shutout and Columbus gets a much needed two points and we'll try to get Elvis to join Ryan Callahan as Brad Larson handshakes and hugs.